Alright, so this is my uh, extended version of my first animation and first of all I was trying to draw or animate Donovan because because of there was no Donovan animation or just because it was kind of funny you know it's kind of fucked up way kind of funny so but I thought that yeah it's kind of weird it's too much weird for the even for the uh, YouTube I think uh, so that's why I came back to the guts uh, <coughs> animation and I thought of uh, making a extended version on and to be honest I I didn't know how to do the sword animation and all because I don't think uh, even uh, in the anime and all, even in the movie and on the 97 version anime, they didn't have uh, good fight scenes and all. I mean, it's all good, but it's not not great. Like uh, it could be much better. The 97 was uh, kind of old so you can see they had some limitation and all so it was understandable but in the movie it was uh they used not just the movie but the 2016 and 17 version they used a lot of 3d and i think most of the action scenes were o almost 3d so i didn't know much about how to make and fight with a giant sword and all because if I don't make the fight scenes or the wielding of the sword some somewhat heavy it, it will look like the 2016-17 version because in that uh, in that series it the sword feels like it's a paper it doesn't have the weight and all so I just made uh so I just made a very different approach by just guts leaping on the ground from the above and now stabbing to this I made a new kind of monster it was like a cursed cursed dog you know it was like a dog or a hound got cursed and also they transform into some weird kind of face pig pig like face but uh, the body is kind of like dog you know and so it was this the this animation was kind of uh, it was okay it wasn't very tough at all for me because I got much experience from the first two and so <coughs> I tried to do less work with more efficient way and I think I did some of that but uh, I think I took uh, two to three days I think I uh, it took me two days not j just straight up two days but uh, I think uh, seven hours a day i think and uh it was kind of tiresome i took one day off at the uh at the second day i took off uh i didn't draw or animate anything i just didn't do any of this stuff and i did the half of it on the third one i was trying to do some uh I was trying to do a long version one uh, with much more action, but uh, I think I got demotivated. Just just as I said on my earlier video, that I I get demotivated after I stop something, or I mm, I keep something to draw or to do something on later on. 
and not just finishing on the the time when I sit for the work and all. So yeah. So in here I try to do his facial expression and all, but then I thought that uh, <coughs> the angle wasn't correct and all, and it doesn't look. I mean, it doesn't convey much emotions on that, and so I change it. And this was kind of challenging for me, this animation, because it had to be... It was so much stuff going on in here. I had to uh, animate all of the uh, mo moments of the hound, and I had to do every single f frame for the that and I had to do the background I had to do the background and I tried to put some uh, trees and all which uh, make the effects of how uh, the as as we are the camera is going with the hound running and all and the background is going backwards and all and I had to make two more small little hound like they are in a pack and trying to attack guts which was uh, I had to do in different uh, animation folders so that uh, it won't it uh, won't looks like it's uh, they all are try uh, running uh, at the same motion and all they all have to looks uh, uh, or feel or they all must be running at different motion some of them will be faster some of them will be slower uh, so that it will looks like that they are different uh, creatures or different uh, hounds and all and so after that, I try to make here yeah, a guts uh, smiling one. This wasn't very tough. The tough part was that the smoke uh, on the background that I made. It was. Uh, it's kind of. It's kind of weird tough because it's it's a it's a same frame used for multiple times as you can see it's uh in the animation it's kind of it's kind of moving but it's not really uh, you can see it's uh the f i've used the same frames and all but the trick part uh the hard part is that you have to make it looks like it's kind of uh kind of moving in a way because most of the time uh some of the things don't stick up like uh, they don't seem to be like moving forward and all if, even when you're using the same frames and all it kind of looks like it's a loop which is going backward and forward like a gif and all and all but <coughs> you have to make the illusion of it's going forward but uh, it's not really so it's kind of it's kind of weird w to explain and I don't know how to explain it but uh, it's kind of difficult for me so moving on this crossbow scene for uh, my first uh, I thought to make uh, firstly uh, a sword barrel but I thought that it's kind of way difficult because I didn't know how to do it I mean, if I had to do it, I have to make it uh, properly because I can just m make a stick stick fight fighting as guts and all. I have to make his his whole body and all, and his sword is too big that I have to kind of make things impactful. If I make uh, if I took the camera to uh, too far away from guts, and then it would be look like that guts is kind of small in size and all. So, 
uh, that's why I didn't took the risk and all. The crossbow scene was kind of hard, but it wasn't really. It's it was uh, wasn't hard, but it w took me time. And so th the second phase of the hounds running, I think I should have done or I should have reused the uh, first hound scene where they were running but I don't know it I may be I may have done mistakes on this one because not not that uh, I had made some mistakes but I could have made much more efficient by using the old stuff and all old animation and all but I think I I wanted to make it more uh, real so if the, it would be a different animation then it would feel like oh it's a continuation and not just using the same scene, scenes and all and by the way it's just uh, one scene away from the running one so people might get oh it's the same s scene so that kind of stuff <coughs> on on the next one this one was uh in here i have used some tricks and all so it was it took me time but it wasn't very hard i just uh uh i just used the crop one or select uh, what that call a lasso i think and i just cut it out and just move the hand part a little bit and as you can see i just move the body a little bit upside and a little bit backwards so it would looks like when you are shooting a crossbow the force of the crossbow is hitting you back just like the gun and all so that kind of stuff and I had to animate the hairs and the cape differently so it wouldn't look like it's kind of uh, looping and all <coughs> and so this scene this this uh, was one of the most easiest one because I just have to uh, move the cape and uh, do this little bit crossbow and all and but the hand part hand of the uh, hound was kind of difficult it's it was the most challenging part from th from this scene not from the whole animation it wasn't much but and so again i tried uh i was trying to make uh, guts shooting from his crossbow from the front front face and all but then i thought uh, it would be it would take a lot of time i f in first i thought that i would be showing guts as shooting from his crossbow from the front and then the camera will be rise up as uh, the hound comes from behind uh, leaping uh, leaping towards him to uh, kill him and on the next scene the guts will uh, the camera will be behind from uh, the guts from the view of the hound and the guts will move his uh, left arm uh, left arm to the screen and boom he will shot a cannon that was my f first initial idea but uh, then i thought that yeah it's kind of good but it's kind of uh, i i don't know i didn't feel i didn't thought it would feel right so i wanted to do something else i wanted to make it more kind of exciting because it would feel like just just uh, just some frames not animation but just some frames sliding and all so in here I made the whole uh, running animation from POV of the uh, cursed town and then I had to uh, on the on the different uh, animation layer I had to make the small guts and just animate it to come closer I know I can do that all in the after effects and all but I 
haven't learned that and all and I need to learn that and because of I don't I didn't learn after effects and all and uh, I was kind of very lazy and all about that I just tried to make guts uh, uh, guts from behind getting closer by just uh, cropping or zooming in the that scene and all and lastly when the the zoom one uh, the guts get closer I had to redraw every frame and all as guts moving his left arm to the screen and uh, doing the canon thing and all this one took me kinda uh, time uh, at first I thought that I made a mistake to do this one because it's kinda like I didn't do many of this kind of detail especially on the arms and the body as you can see I haven't done much on the body animation and all I always do the face and the arms and all just a part of the body not the whole body and if I did any of that uh, full body animation and all it's kind of like the small uh, in a s small size and all not on the close up and all so this was uh, kind of hard and I think uh, I think I did just just okay f with the uh, guts face and all so and and I thought that it would have uh, the whole thing will have a lot of mistakes and all because uh, because of the how how the guts moving uh, from looking front from to the back it had to the head has to move in a flow way so that it would feel like guts is moving his hand to to, to backwards to the camera so it's uh, it was good that it kind of uh, got I got uh, kind of got it correct and so I made the cape with different animation folder uh, this as you can see I just made the cape rough and all I mean it's kind of uh, people gonna get it because guts cape is kind of something that it's not clean and uh, clean at all it's just rough and all and it's it's just like uh, a big old rug and black rug and all so yeah and that's it <laughs> I think I'm done with guts animation for uh, for a while I think I'll do my own animation and I'll try to make my own uh, I'll try to make my own story and all if possible so uh, yeah I hope I will upload it as I can and I hope people will watch it so that's for all